Well, Kat Carney was 28 years old and 240 pounds. She knew only a major law, life altering decision could save her. Look. As far back as I can remember, I was heavy. I'd be riding the school bus, and someone would be like, I can't sit next to her because there's no room. Anytime something went wrong, it was just habit. Go through the drive through, Burger King, get supersize everything. Every time I would go up a size, I would be like, wow, these people are cutting these clothes smaller. Because it couldn't be me. I was a working actor. It got to a point where I was sent home from a couple of jobs. I would get there, and the clothes just wouldn't fit. I started having some physical problems. My back was starting to hurt me. Called the doctor, went in, I got on the scale. I expected it to stop at 160, and I remember so clearly, 240 pounds. And that's all that was just ringing in my head. That's like heavyweight boxers way. I just felt lost. I was feeling so out of control with my life in general. I was just kind of stuffing it down with food. I just remember thinking, I just want to go to sleep and not wake up. That was when I hit rock bottom. I remember looking at my body thinking, this has to go. I knew that I couldn't do what I needed to do to get healthy while I was working. I needed to take easily a year off. A friend of mine gave me a book, and it was Make the Connection. And I remember reading that Oprah worked out twice a day. And I was thinking, wow, she's like really busy. If she works out twice a day, I can work out twice a day. My motto was no excuses. I needed to relearn my relationship with food. I needed to relearn my relationship with physical activity. 14 months later, I was 90 pounds lighter. It's just changing your mind. I realized that my weight was a mask all my life. I had felt virtually invisible. Now I'm a health reporter for CNN oh, Headline News. What about those energy bars? And now when I feel stressed out, most of the time, head to the gym. People ask me, did you have a personal trainer? I said, yeah, I had Bob Green. There was something about the way he speaks that spoke to me and encouraged me to do it and helped me understand the steps that I needed to take to do what I needed to do to be here. Kat has maintained her incredible weight loss of 90 pounds for over four years. Coming out, Kat Carney. <laughs> yes, I know. That's how you all. That's how she discovered you. So you discovered him what when the, he was doing make the connection. Yes. Yeah. And you did the book and a friend of I was just at at a friend's house and she was like, oh, I got this great book and she gave it to me and I was like, another exercise book and you know I took it home and I started reading it and just something just clicked. And again, is when I read that, you know, you worked out twice a day, I was like, twice yeah, a day. yeah. I have no, I have no excuse, because, and I didn't know you, but I figured, she's a little busy. A little bit. <laughs> a little bit, a little bit. So if Oprah can do twice a day, I can do twice Which a day. Which means you just have to make it the priority. What did you learn in the process of losing? What did you learn? One of the big things was to look at big obstacles as little tiny obstacles and start with them one by one. And I also realized that I was my biggest obstacle. I was mm -hmm. the one who was getting in my way. I was the one who was talking myself out of things. And so I started saying nice things to myself instead of like, I can't do this, or this is hard. I would replace it with, I love exercising. You know? <laughs> <laughs> like that. Well, what Kat did that was very important, uh, so many people think of the future and picture themselves thin yeah. and ignore where they are right now. And Kat was able to think about the present and find some happiness uh, in the present. And then you're 100 times more likely to wake up the next day, lace up the sneakers, and do what you need to do to live a fulfilled life. So that's, Little goals. Yeah, exactly. It's all done in small steps. Okay. It's so good to see you because you look good, girl. You look good. Good to see you, too. You look good. <laughs> okay.